welcome in to another woolly review we are going to do drops musket today now the cheapest place that i have found this is um wool warehouse for i think it was one pound ten one pounds ten pence it is on other um sites for the same price right now but it is marked down um i've chosen the wool warehouse because the shipping is of better value than some other sites so i'll be using my beanie custom hook um for this particular review this is a hundred percent mercerized cotton now we don't really care about the color on here that's not what we re we're reviewing but if you are interested it is color 61 they recommend a four millimeter needle this is a 50 gram ball which has 100 meters or 109 yards approximately so any other details they will be down below just below the like button and the subscribe button if you're willing um also to note the custom beanie hook is from Jelena Designs. She is linked down below also. Very, very good deal on custom made hooks of your choosing. Let's move that just for a moment. Put it on me, me winder holder thingy. And let's have a look. Now it feels kind of like it looks in the sense of it's sheeny it looks silky it feels it too but let's see how it is to work up I've never used it before so this is a first for me I am worried about the splitting but we will find out soon so no squeaking that's good I'm going at my standard pace and there's no splitting yet looks really nice i like i like the sheeny on it i like the sheeny i don't know if that's a technical term but i'm using it for this review so here move winder move so here it is feeling quite nice in the fingers almost like it's not there it's very very light very very smooth i am aware that i am concentrating on what i'm doing rather than just going for it and i think that's probably because it is a lighter weight than i've been using recently but I need to get used to that because I'm going back to a lighter weight for something I'm about to start making. So let's let's go up to hmm, okay. Let's go in with a double. I've got a sense that this is going to frog really nicely as well. Although part of me is saying, nope, that is going to kink right up. And I've just split it there, which was not my intention. But it has happened. It has split. And I don't know what I'm doing. We're not judging my stitches, okay? We are not judging my stitches. We are just here to see how it works up, what it's like to use. We're not judging my crochet skills today. You can do that another day. Just not today. Okay. Oops. I've got to say, using it, 
Oh, it's split again. Oh, no. Drat it. Um, I've got to say, using it, apart from those couple of splits that just happened, which I wasn't expecting. Um, I quite like this to work with. It's gliding really nicely on the hook. Oops, wrong one. Let's split again. But I managed to save it that time. Let's go along. That's not too bad. The only bad thing is, you see how it's split there? That's not good. I mean, that tends to be the norm with um, cotton kind of goes with the territory a lot of the time but it doesn't mean it's nice oh for heaven's sake are you happier that way round is that better had my wool rind of the wrong way round i apologize it's good to talk to inanimate objects it makes me feel clever <laughs> even if it means the actual opposite oh it's still not wanting to know oh come on get with the game and i'll just put a a double in the last one and then we'll put beanie down Okay, I would so wear that on my skin. It feels very light. It feels as silky as it looks. I am going to have a problem when I get there and have to frog that past my tail because I stupidly crocheted it in. There we go. That's better. Um, of course. There's no stretch to it because it is cotton. But let's see how it frogs. Let's see how kinky it gets. So a slow frog. It's fine, it seems. Let's go quick. Oh, look at the kink on that. Oh, my word. Look at the kink on that. That's not a good thing. Oh dear. Look at that. That's like somebody just dropped their toupee on my table. Okay. So drops muscat. Oh my word. Oh my word. It's like an explosion in a mattress factory. So is there anything that I meant? What is on the inside? Oh, about their patterns and the washing instructions, which are going to be down below anyway. Okay, so what's the verdict, huh? One ladybird, if it was the only thing they had, would have walk away? No. Would I be kind of annoyed if what I wanted wasn't there, but only that was? No. Would I be like, oh, it's not what I was looking for, but it will do. No. No. 
would I be yeah that's fine that was my second choice I think I'm going to go with this one it would be way too much pushing it to four and a half so I'm going to keep it on four um and that's purely because the splitting is there it is unfortunately it is nice and soft the sheen on it the silkiness of it it's nice it glides really really nicely on the hook but that bit of splitting is a little bit of a pain and if it wasn't for the splitting it would get the full five but for today drops muscat four four out of five ladybirds and a beanie work of approval as well hopefully this review was of some use to you maybe if it was please give a thumbs up maybe think about subscribing which is down there too and hopefully i'll see you guys next week for more take care bye bye